hey, we've been telling you for years, fall is for planting. Seems like some of you may not believe us, but here are the facts. First of all, plants love warm soil temperatures and cool leaf temperatures. The cooler the ambient temperature in the fall, it doesn't bake the soil like the summertime and encourages roots to grow and anchor in the soil. That that is probably key. The, it's all it's all about the the roots that grow in the fall. What about watering soil? Do you have to water as much in the fall? No, you have to water less. You know, we don't have that intense you know uh, dryness that we have in the summer. That's right, and it's a natural rainy season yeah. followed up by winter where plants are are somewhat dormant and then another naturally rainy season so you kind of get two back-to-back rainy seasons so that it can keep those plants uh, growing the only thing in the winter that you really need to worry about is that the winter burn some plants get but it's generally they have happy roots and they grow out of it but uh i tell you it, it is the absolute best time you know it develops plants that are more resistant to resistant to drought because those roots are growing deeper. And if you have deeper growing roots, it's past that drought zone in the soil. And I'll tell you what, there's less insect disease, uh, issues and disease issues in the fall. And it's also, it's the end of the insect mating season. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. you're not going to have, like, your your plants are not going to be a magnet to insects, and you won't have any insect problems until possibly the following late fall. Uh, so, again, it, it is, again, it's a great time to uh, be getting out there and planting a new landscape. Uh, there's also another financial aspect, right, Julio? Oh, yeah, there's always a financial aspect. Well, yeah. well, because garden centers are putting plants Place. on clearance. Yes, that's right. you know. Hey, they may look a little shop-worn, and they probably are just have been there, but their roots are alive and thriving. They're very healthy. Don't let those yellow spots on the leaves bother you. Um, the amount of sunlight is declining, and the leaves are starting to change color, but the plants themselves are super healthy because their roots are healthy. It's a great time to be outside too. Putting on, you know, it's 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 nice today. It's a beautiful day right. today, but having a hoodie on oh, and yeah. just being able to work outside or light jacket. It's a great it's a time, time of the year just to be outside. You're not going to be sweating like to death and and really hating, you know, hating life hating because life. you're like <laughs> melting. Yeah. It is a great time to plant. Um, and, and again, I want to say, you know, like your local garden center is putting things on clearance. Uh, don't beat them up. I mean, I, I'll never forget. I had, I had a guy. We had, we had certain plants. We were just overstocked, and it was fall, and, and we needed to get rid of them. We had them 75% off. 75% off. That was out that's outrageous yeah, in an earth. <laughs> yeah. The guy the guy goes, What do you do for cash? <laughs> what do you do for I cash? I almost knocked his block off. I was like, here uh hello. Uh, yeah. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah, we, we anyway. Can't go, can't go any further. <laughs> so your your garden centers are gonna have stuff. Um some things may change. They may like say, guess what? They're you know, it is taken as is. You, you may that they may not be warranted like they would be at full price, but honestly, the roots are happy and healthy. They're going to be fine. That uh, they're going to establish. They're going to establish after you plant them. The plants are dying to get planted in the ground. Some are a little pot bound, so you got to make sure that you scarify the roots on the side so that they grow a little bit. How about perennials, Julio? Like, we've got some perennials that are not looking great. Yeah, right. Would you have any fear of planting perennials now? No, not at all. You know, like, like you were, we were talking about, you know, the root systems are going to grow right now at this point. So it's not just yeah. woody shrubs. No. It's also, also perennials. perennials. Yeah. Perennials. And, again, they're going to grow. They're going to grow. Yeah. Um, uh, I, I saw a very savvy gardener uh, buying. We had what we call bloomer's yard sale. 
and we had some plants in in there and that uh, she picked up all of those early i guess it's late winter early spring flowering plants that were kind of leftovers you know and the hellebores she was hellebores. picking oh, up the yeah. hellebores. hellebores and what was interesting is like they go somewhat dormant in the summertime but unless they're in the shade she saw some with a little bit of new growth and man she gobbled them up, up. Yeah, and that she gobbled them up she got a deal yeah. she got a deal and it's something that you need to know and and that garden centers are more than happy to help they say what's the best deal here right. you is. know what should i not miss <clears throat> what should I maybe should i wait till the spring to buy this or should i buy this mm-hmm. now um if you find plants that you like buy them right especially when they're 75 percent where do you yeah. where now, else do again you, they're not all 70 percent, yes. but they are on different types of sales and yeah, some things are sale. like our our trees are all on clearance right now i mean so and what i mean by trees is shade and flowering trees but also ornamental, ornamental. trees yeah. dwarf japanese maples on sale. sale blood good maples on sale uh we have <laughs> i'm keeping my eye on and uh, thinking whether it's yeah. going to end up in the back of my car (laughs) but there's a coral bark maple that's on sale that that you know it's like wow you know it's tempting (laughs) it is tempting and it's one of those plants where it doesn't have many leaves on it but But the coral bark's there and the roots are healthy and it just through uh, and and there's some of those bizarre um bizarre plants like that eskimo kiss oh yeah a type of maple Maple, and again Go to your local garden center. You'd be surprised what you get. So. Yeah. Um, this year seems to be a, a year where people, let's just say, took a little time off from, yeah. you know, their spring landscape needs. But uh, yeah, can, I tell you what, can come back. <laughs> get out to your local yeah, garden back, center and take a look around. You know, it's like we just got through Labor Day and you know, furniture sale, Labor Day. You know, yeah, yeah, Day it's sale. it's that same type That's of of sales going on at your local it's garden ex- center right yeah. now. So get out there and take a look what they've got. Oh, yeah, it's exciting, isn't it? Yeah, we've been putting golf putting up a hedge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now's the go. time. Mm-hmm. Now is the time.